we're very fortunate that we have a very close knit group of players and uh, support team. So anytime we can get together in the one place at the one time and spend some some time together, it's it's always really good fun. It's Andy's first day practicing, I think everyone can see how much he's enjoying it already. He's been part of the team again, uh, and all the players feel that it's a little bit different coming into this tie because it's not like we haven't seen each other for the last you know six weeks in Paris right through the grass court season, but it's still different because it's. It's more fleeting visits and everyone's got their own coaching teams and matches, so it's nice to get together. I think Jamie making a slam final, uh, and Gents Doubles has obviously done it in mix before, but in, in Gents Doubles is big for him at career high ranking, as you say now. Uh, and for James to walk out of court here, you know, they always do the resume from the MC and eventually it comes to ranking. I'm sure it's a bit of a, oh, you know, I'd like to be how he can actually walk out as 89 in the world and make him feel that bit bigger and that bit taller uh, and more confident. But more importantly, I think, for both of them, how much as Davis Cup is, is important to us right now, for their summer and the rest of the second half of the year, having those rankings to build on is really important. Very different tie. Well, one, because you know we were away on a, on a very slow court in Naples, uh, which is a very challenging environment. And I think we put up a really good fight. Uh, there's a few factors working against us there. But I think here, OK, we've got home advantage, but to be honest, with, with the French have played over the grass court season, Gasquet obviously making semis. Simon has had three great tournaments on grass. Uh, we know what Song has done in the past, uh, and Mahou has won a singles title and a doubles title on grass. So they come in with as much grass court form as, form as any nation, and they're definitely the strongest team uh, in all of Davis Cup. There's no doubt about that. So it's a, it's a, it's a tough draw if you look across the other quarterfinal matches. Uh, I think we've probably been given the biggest ask here, but I think we'll give it our best shot. It can have a huge amount, and it's important that we all get it right, because otherwise we'll, we'll miss the opportunity of what a home tie should be. Um, anyone that's not been before should probably try and YouTube a few clips of the Glasgow tie, and that's exactly how you support a Davis Cup team. They were absolutely magnificent, so if the crowd here can get anywhere close to that, we'll be in good shape.